Can a plant actually see? Discover the extraordinary world of the shape-shifting marvel, Boquilla trifolia later. Found in the South American countries of Chile and Argentina, Boquilla is not your ordinary vine. It possesses a remarkable ability to mimic the leaves of its host trees. And this ability is not limited to one or two trees, but any host tree it grows on. How it manages this, is where some scientists believe, that it might be, seeing, the shape of the leaves it mimics. Let's look deeper into this strange shapeshifter, and the different theories that have been proposed to explain, why and how Bokila shows this behavior. The, why, part of the question is easy to answer, mimicking the leaves of the host tree, allows it to hide from leaf herbivores, that might specifically feed on its leaves. Now coming to how it does this, is where things get interesting and mysterious. Let's look at the two most popular explanations for this behavior. The first theory is that of horizontal gene transfer. This basically means, that the vine is getting the genes of the host plant, through some medium, and quickly adapting based on the transferred genetic material. This is totally different from genes being transferred from a parent to an offspring, but rather one organism giving its genes to another organism, which then inherits its traits. Horizontal gene transfer has been commonly observed, in single-celled organisms like bacteria. It helps them adapt to different environments and even exhibit antibiotic resistance. In multicellular organisms, this behavior has been previously observed between rice and millets. It is still not clear how complex organisms swap genes so quickly, as to mimic leaves, every time the Bokila vine grows on a tree. One possible explanation is involving airborne bacteria, that might be carrying the genetic material from the host plant, to the Bokila vine. The transferred material is integrated into Bokila genes, helping it change shape. It is extraordinary, and scary at the same time. Imagine getting someone's physical features through airborne bacteria. The second, equally wild theory is around Bokila's ability to see. Theories around plants' ability to see have been floating around since 1905, first proposed by Austrian botanist Gottlieb Haberlandt. He suggested, that outer layer of cells on leaves can act as a convex lens, and send light to photoreceptors underneath. He called these plant ocelli, which means a simple eye. This is what helps plants grow towards light. The concept has been researched by various scientists. In a recent study on Bokila, scientists replaced the host plant with a plastic plant, to rule out any chemical, or gene transfer. Bokila vine was able to mimic the leaves of the plastic plant as well. However, some branches were kept under a wooden shelf, away from the direct line of sight. To everyone's surprise, the shape of the leaves on these branches did not change. Although the study had limitations, and a lot more needs to be researched, but the idea itself is enough to give us goosebumps. The more we know about the world around us, makes us realize how little we actually know.